go to breakfast. Shayo. Shayo. Choco bow for the presunto. Nothing to discuss. Cause I'm the poor wife. Fault and without any doubt. I'm a me happy adult. I don't go feed the girl. I don't go feed the girl. It's all though. I'm a mind as you can talk. I put my life into my job. And I know I'm in trouble. Yo, what's up, guys? Welcome to another day in the life of a beginner for trader. If you are new to the channel, please hit that like button and the subscribe button and show some love for your boy. And you have a, if you are a retaining subscriber, I appreciate you, man. You're giving me motivation and now. Uh, yeah. So today, the main purpose of this video is to show you the strategy that I use from scratch. Not from scratch, scratch, but from scratch. So um, just for a heads up, I am not teaching you this strategy. I am showing you because uh, there's some things that I'm also trying to figure out about this strategy you know so I'll be showing you how I trade the strategy of course and um yeah man so I'm trying something different for this video I am trying to record a full day in a life from the morning until dark time until it's night because you know how day in lives go they be showing you the, the things that they want you to see and then not the whole day, you know, cause, cause yeah, man. So I'm trying something different, trying to record my whole day in life. But that's if I still have time, man. Cause, you know, something might pitch up, something might come up. And um, yeah, man. So I still have to eat, still have to bath, and I'm currently charging my laptop. After I'm done with those two, those two tasks, I'm gonna make the charts, man. You know, the work don't stop. Yeah, man. Show some love for your boy and stick around in this video. And um, just for the heads up, I think this video is going to be a bit long. I think this video is going to be a bit long, but um, we'll see. So, right now, still have to bath and eat then. But three shots, baby. Yo guys, so I'm done bathing, I'm done eating, and um, just like I said, some things might come up. So I just figured out that I have to go somewhere, and um, my laptop is still charging. So I have to go somewhere real quick. Then um, as soon as I come back, I'm going to reveal. I'm going to show you what I will be showing you. So um, yeah, man.
Yo, 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 guys. Hope you're doing good. Hope you're doing fine. Hope your day, hope your day is going well. And um, like I said, man, this is the main purpose of this video. So this part of the video, I'll be showing you the strategy that I use when I trade. So in this strategy, I took a few SMC concepts and um, you know, mix and match. So. As I said, this strategy consists of the SMC concepts. So, if you're not familiar with the SMC concepts, then um, I suggest you start doing so. And um, I will be showing you. I will not be teaching. I will be showing you because there's some things that I have to still figure out about this strategy. So, um, yeah, I man, let's get it to what we came for. So, let me scroll down. So, man, um, basically. The basics of the SMC concepts: break of structures, higher lows, higher highs, and stuff. So, let's just say this line is the four-hour chart. I can see you. Okay, this is a four-hour chart. I can see break of structure right here. Right. This break of structure created what? A higher low. Right. Created a higher low. Then it went further to turn back and broke structure once again. That broke of but that break of structure created a what a high low. Went further to create another break of structure, which created another higher low. Right? So this is basically the basics. This is the basics. Then I can see okay, we're in an overall uptrend. So in this, in this, in this, in this, in this chart, I'll be looking for buys only because we in the market. I want to follow the trend. I don't want to trade against the trend, you know. So I basically do the top down analysis, start on a four hour. Then okay, as soon as I see we in an uptrend, scale down to the 50 minute. Okay, so the red line is the 15 minute, right? is how the 15 minute moves inside this black line which is the 4 hour chart drawn above us right so let me draw the 4 hour higher highs higher lows let me draw the 4 hour high lows this is major structure the 4 hour this is major structure so I can see here break of structure right on the 15 minute chart let me just see Frame, right 15 minute time frame so I can see break of structure right here break of structure again then break of structure again and break of structure again right here so what I want to see is a trend change on the 15 minute chart indicating that the 4 hour chart will be pulling back so I'm um, basically uh, 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 interpreting the move on the four hour chart so i see a what a charge aka the change of character right i see a change of character let me just mark it um, train change okay i see a train change right here on the 15 minute indicating that the four hour will be pulling back right so if you don't know what the trend change is let me try to explain it real quick so let's just say the market is going up down up down up down up down okay so the market creates what higher highs higher highs but i usually look at the recent higher not higher highs higher lows i look at the recent higher lows 
right? And in an uptrend. Look at the recent high lows. So I usually delete the the the, the, the one that don't matter, right? And look at the. So what a pain change is is the market breaking breaking this this um higher low right here indicating that we will be going to the downside we don't know until when but we will be going to the downside and rest assured that this doesn't happen every time but it does happen majority of the times that i've seen it so as you can see it broke the recent higher low right so this is what we are seeing here on the 15 minute chart break of structure right here so as i see uh not a break of structure a trend change as i witness this trend change of 15 minute chart i go back to my four hour chart so what am i looking at at my four hour chart i'm looking for my fibonacci tool so that it can turn on my 50 percent zone which is my golden zone i put my 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 fibonacci from the low to the high right then i can see you i can see that price is in my golden zone right i can see that price is in my golden zone then i'll scale back as price is in my golden zone on the four hour chart scale down to my 15 minute chart right scale down to my 15 minute chart what do I want to see on my 15 minute chart? Another trend change indicating that we will be changing direction to the upside. So the pullback will be over at this point. Right? What I want to do is to place a trade right here. Put the stop loss under recent uh, lower high of the 4 hour chart. Then I target the higher high depending on the, 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 depending on the price action on the left side. So I usually go for the higher high, the 4 hour higher high, then I let it play out till it hit my TP. So since you have a brief understanding of my strategy, let me go to some life examples if I will get any. Because this video, I said I will script this video but I didn't, I didn't script it because it was a lot of work. So I started on a 15 minute chart as I all know. Okay, let me go on the GBP, JPY. Right. Okay. On the 4 hour chart, I can see that, let's start over here, I can see that price broke structure, right, broke structure, let's call it um, the, the BOS, break of structure, right, um, no, okay, um, let me just delete this real quick, okay, broke structure right here, right, Let's call it uh, the BOS. The BOS, yes. BOS. Call it the BOS. Then I witnessed the BOS created a what? A higher low, right? Then it went up and it pulled back, right? So let me just highlight the zone right here. This is the four hour chart. So let me draw those lines. So went up, came down, went back up, came down, went back up again. Um okay, let me start all over. Went up, came down, push, pull back. Right? Then another push to create a break of structure. Let me make it black. So this is a four hour chart, right? So as this for as this break of structure was created, this gray zone, I want to zoom in into my 15 minute chart. Zoom in into my 15 minute chart. Okay. I want to see what price is at. Okay. Now right now I'm on the 15 minute chart. 15 minute chart I'm following a what? A minor structure a minor structure right minor structure then I'm following minor structure structure break created a lower high remember that this is a forward chart right 
spray of structure create another lower high right break of structure again create another what lower high on the 15 minute I see another break of structure create a lower high which is this one that got broken so this is the structure that created the TC right train change and what I say about the train change um what I say about the train change changes direction to the downside right as soon as I see we in the we 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 we, we form the train change I go to the what the four hour chart see this black line the four hour chart right so the black line is the four hour chart if you can the four hour is the black chart this is the black line I mean go back to the four hour chart let me look for price okay it's here okay this is where we created the TC inside the zone right so I draw my Fibonacci to no, I have to low. Right. So this price didn't exactly tap into my my what my zone. Okay, but let's say this for example, let's say it did tap into my zone. Let me just take a picture real quick. Okay, let's say they tap into my zone then what I want to do is what zoom in into the 15 minute chart right zoom in into the 15 minute chart right zoom in into the 15 minute chart and what do I want to see a train change I want to see a train change. I want to see a train change. Right? So let me follow the market structure to the upside. So we created structure right here. Right? Then created a what? A lower high. Created another brick of structure right here. Created a what? created a what lower high right so here is where the magic happened so this line right here let me make it a different color this orange line right here is my recent recent let me make it more bold this bold line right here is my recent lower high so I wait until price so okay price okay price came here turned back here and I'm waiting I'm waiting for break of structure but then it doesn't happen it, but it, it does what break of structure which indicates a what a train change remember we're on the 15 minute chart we raise this this is a what a train change right there's a train change when this happens I do what take my take my um my 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 uh, uh, execute the trade price under price under my my recent higher low on the four hour chart then I target the high right this is a profit then oh you can target whatever high you want let's say I like to go for twos to one um Okay, this one is fine. As you can see, when we executed, we were in the trade and we went straight into profit. So, guys, that's basically how how this strategy works for me. This is how it works. So, um, I hope you got value out of this video. If you didn't think I explained properly, just 
just just just comment down below and i will probably do it again if i if i see that a lot of people didn't understand what i was saying so um yeah man that is how i use my smc trading strategy so guys that is it for today's video i hope you learned something or you find you found motivation in this video so um, i'll be ending the video right here and um tune in into the next video man so if you haven't smashed that subscribe button i'd appreciate it if you do smash that subscribe button and press that like button and um yes man have a good one peace I'm